We are now in Hosh Nusri area in the eastern Ghouta countryside of the capital Damascus. This area has been recently taken by the Syrian army during a wide scale offensive. At this point, thousands of civilians are gathering today to evacuate their areas in eastern Ghouta. The evacuation of civilians have been called for by the government for a long time, but as the Syrian army is advancing in eastern Ghouta, which is the last threat to the capital Damascus, thousands of people are leaving to toward government controlled areas, toward government run shelters. Yesterday, around 12,000 people left. Today, so far, more than 2,000 people left their areas in eastern Ghouta. Now this is the gathering point of the people as we can see. We can see families, men, women and children. They are assembling here at this point to be later transported by buses to government run shelters. This is a massive evacuation from Eastern Ghouta. As we can see, we can see the people who have been living in rebel held areas for six years. Now they are out and they are seeking safety in shelters outside their battle zone. As we can see, women, children, all looking tired, are gathering today waiting for their turn to get on the bus and go to a shelter where they can find some rest from the battles. شلون شو حاسه اليوم انت طالعه من من هوني والله فرحتي ما عطيت لا حدا يا اخي ابني صار لي ثلاث سنين ما شفته ان شاء الله هلا نلتقي فيه شي از شي از فروم ذا تاون اوف اوتايا اولسو ان ايسترن غوتا اند شي از اوت توداي شي سيد ذات هير هابينس از اندسكرايبل شي از جوين تو بي ريونايت ويز هير سون ويتش شي هازنت سين فور 8 ييرز يعطيك العافيه The battles in Eastern Ghouta have been go uh, have been ongoing since late last month, uh, and uh, the evacuation of civilians, as we have said, uh, is part of uh, granting them safety. Uh, as the uh, situation in Eastern Ghouta is intensifying, the government has previously accused the rebels of preventing civilians from leaving. But as the Syrian army advanced and captured over 62 or 70 percent uh, of Eastern Ghouta, the civilians have found uh, ways uh, to leave as the army would open humanitarian corridors in each place they enter so that they can give the civilians a chance uh, to leave. We can see most of those people are women and children. The number of children is high. يعطيك العافية يا حجي حضرتك من وين؟ من من وين من جوا؟ من وين حضرتك؟ من الميلان شلون كان وضعكم جوا؟ الوضع ما علينا هلا أنت كيف حاسس لما طالع؟ حاسس أنا مرتاح مرتاح هلا حاسس؟ Okay, so he's also from a town inside Eastern Ghouta uh, he, he could also could only uh, describe his feelings as feeling safe which uh, has been taken for granted in many places, but for those people, it's all that they have dreamed of. يعطيك العافية حضرتك من وين من جوا من غوطة؟ أنا من حوش الدوارة من هون حوش الدوارة إيه؟ كيف حاسس اللي أنت اليوم جاي لهون؟ والله الحمد لله اليوم بخير لأنه احنا كنا بعربين وطلعنا من عربين لهون 
كيف الوضع جوا انت ووضعكم كمدنيين وهلا كيف حاسين؟ هلا مرتاحين كثير اما الوضع كان تعبان كثير جوا لا يخلونا نطلع ولا يخلونا نفوت بنوب قطعا من جوا من جوا المسلحين؟ ايوه هي سيد ذات الريبلز بريفنتد ذيم فروم ليفينغ بيفور اند ذات ناو ذي ار فيلينغ بير سيف شو 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 بتحلم بالمستقبل؟ بتحلم بترجع على بيتك شو شو بتحلم؟ لا بحلم ارجع على بيتي لان انا مالي مستقبل غير بيتي وارضي وبلدنا هي سوريا He's, uh, he's dreaming of returning to his house one day, to his uh, land, because he said that his house is all he's got. Artikel <laughs> Afi. As we have mentioned before, thousands of uh, people, thousands of families are leaving Eastern Ghouta. They have been pouring out of the rebel held areas since yesterday in large numbers. Yesterday, more than 12,000 people left. Today, over 12, over 2,000 have so far left. We can see people with medical conditions, with medical conditions uh, uh, leaving. Uh, this is all as a result of the government forces' advancement in Eastern Ghouta. They are opening roads for people to flee. Most of those people are accusing the rebels of preventing them from leaving before, but now, as the army have taken 70% of Eastern Ghouta, people are more free to leave and to seek safety in shelters here in the, in the capital. Actually, this, this, this large number of people has been able to come out from Eastern Ghouta after seven years of war. They have been locked in that area for so long. Many of them haven't even visited the capital for seven years. كيف الو... كيف الوضع هلا حاسه؟ بعد ما طلعتوا من جوا؟ مختلف علينا كثير الحمد لله، هلا انتم ناطرين تروحوا لوين؟ نعم لوين ناطرين تروحوا على ال على اساس على عدن على عدن كيف احساسكم اليوم؟ والله مرتاحين كثير الحمد لله، مرتاحين كثير والله بوجود الجيش العربي السوري مرتاحين كثير الحمد لله الحياة جوا كيف شوي كانت؟ والله حياة صعبة، موت انت صار لك تقريبا سبع سنين ما طلعت على العاصمة لبرا؟ ما طلعنا ايه شو شو بتتخيلوا على دمشق لما بتسمعوا عنا؟ صار لك سبع سنين ما نزلت، شو مشتاق أكثر شيء تروح؟ نعم شو مشتاق أكثر شيء تزوره بالشام؟ والله كل الأماكن، والله عم نحلم حلم إنه نروح عليها بس ما ما حسنا، وهذا اللي صار. هيز أوسو فروم أ بليس إن إيسترن غوتا، هيز أوسو هي سيد ذات هي هازنت بين إيبل تو تو فيزيت ذا كابيتال، ذا سيتي أوف دمشق فور سو لونغ، أند هي سيد ذات ذي ميس إيفري بليس إن دمشق ذات ذي وونت تو فيزيت وانس ذي آر out uh, of here. Okay, as we move uh, further, we can see crowds and crowds of people all over the place. All of them are dreaming of safety. All of them are dreaming of safety out of the battle zones. يعطيك العافية. حضرتك من وين من جوا من غوطة؟ من غير منطقة؟ زينة. كيف وضعكم جوا وهلا شو حاسة؟ هلا حاسة بفرحة كثير لأنه أنقذونا من جوا. كثير كنا جوعانين جوا. كثير علينا قاسيين علينا كثير، اولادنا مثل ما لك شايف، لا لباس، لا اكل، لا شرب. نشكر بشار الاسد، نشكر عناصر طلعونا من الموت. شيز شيز سينج ذات ذي هاف بين ليفينغ ان فيري توف سيتويشن انسايد وذ نو فود، وذ نو بروبر ليفينغ كونديشنز. هير تشيلدرن ار ابيرنتلي سفرينغ فروم فروم ذا لايف انسايد. شيز اولسو اكيوزينغ ذا ريبلز اوف بريفنتينغ ذيم فروم ايتينغ اور فروم ديستريبيوتينغ انف فود تو ذيم. And now that they are feeling more safe. شو شو أمنياتك أنت ل ل ل ل ل بكرة شو بتحلمي؟ أنا مثلاً بعيش إنه بادي سلام وأمان 
She is dreaming of living in peace and security and for her children to have uh, food. Eastern Ghouta is a sprawling uh, region, largely agricultural region, in the eastern countryside of Damascus. It's estimated at 100 square kilometers, constituting of several towns and villages. This area is the last remaining threat to the capital. After the army uh, liberated most of the surroundings of the capital, the north and the west, now Eastern Ghouta is the large remaining threat to the capital. and the government forces are fighting to regain that area. the <laughs> 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 ما كان she said that she's been out of education mostly for the past six years but in the last year she was completely out of school uh, I was asking her about her school back and she said that she she it doesn't contain books, but it puts some of her belongings in her school bag. He said that all of the dream of it was to, to live in a safety and the woman over there she said that they have been without food for three days. She said she, she's uh, she's been living in a, in a in a very tough situation over the past three days. She haven't seen anything. She said her children are uh, have been living without food for three days, and uh, they are uh, expressing uh, gratitude for the Syrian army for saving them and for for bringing them to safety. So as we as we have seen so far, all of the people here are dreaming of safety, of, of living in peace. Even though this, the situation now is not ideal, but the feeling, the sense of safety is all they care about. So this, the crowd, the crowd over there is waiting for their turn, for their paper to be processed and for the for, for their turn to get on the bus while this crowd over here is already on standby as they are waiting to march forward to the buses. We can see several green buses over there. They are uh, being uh, filled with people who are going to uh, government front shelters either here uh, in the nearby Adra area uh, or in a place called Dwer. Which it, we, both of them are actually close to the humanitarian corridors that have been uh, opened recently uh, for uh, the evacuation of civilians, for the people who are fleeing their areas over there. شو طالع الباص هلا أنت كيف وضع كيف الأحاسيس شو شو كنت بتحلم انت وجوا شو شو امنياتك كانت؟ انه نرجع هيك للامل للغوطة ونرجع لبلادنا ان شاء الله. He's also excited about being safe after years of war.
كيف وضعكم كانوا هلا كيف حاسه؟ عايشين بجحيم الحمد لله كنا عايشين بجحيم وهلا الله يفرج علينا الحمد لله رب العالمين كيف وضع اولادك؟ انت كيف تدبري لهم اكل؟ مش فاهمين صرنا ثلاث ايام بلا اكل وبلا خبز الحمد لله رب العالمين لما ما طلعتوا وصلتوا لهون؟ اي والله طلعتكم ثلاث ايام عم تحاولوا تطلعوا ولا ايه. قبل؟ اي والله من ثلاث ايام Uh, she said that uh, she is, they have been uh, trying to evacuate to leave their areas in Eastern Ghouta for three days. Which the situation is very complicated and difficult there. And she also spoke the same that they ha haven't had any food over the past three days. And we can see her little girl here, she's having some uh, bread. يعطيك العافية. قد ايش صار عم تحاول تطلع من الغوطة؟ والله أربع سنين. أربع سنين عم تحاول. والله العظيم. وكل محاولاتك فشلت. آه. والله ما بيخلونا نطلع. الله يوفقك. شو شو بتعتقد السبب؟ ليه؟ بده ياكم شو؟ ما تخبين فينا. ما بيتخبوا فينا. آه كم ولد عندك بالبركة؟ عندي هذا ما عندي غير. Uh, this father, he has only one son. He said that he have uh, he has been trying to uh, to leave uh, Eastern Ghouta, the rebel-held areas in Eastern Ghouta, for four years, but he said he couldn't. He said that the rebels are, were preventing them, and he, and he added that they were uh, taking sh uh, using the the people as a human as a human shield, as he uh, described, and that they were protecting behind the civilians. So if we take a look at the people here, uh, we can see from their faces the amount of, of awareness and the amount of, of, of uh, suffering that they have been subject to. We can see their dusted faces and their shabby clothes. So this is a father and his son. They haven't seen each other for seven years. The son is a soldier in the Syrian army, and the father was locked. إن سعد بيسون غوطة كيف كيف شعورك بعد ما شفته بعد ثلاث سنين؟ شعور لا يوصف احتمل مع النصر احتمل كمان نعم. لسه نعم He has يعني... indescribable feelings of happiness because he has reunited with his father um, شو كان شعورك أنتوا بعاد عن بعض؟ شعور لا يوصف أنتوا تحكوا مع بعض ولا ولا بعيد؟ لا كمان في الزيادة ما كنت لا حكي لا تليفون كان يمنع منه الجوال جوال لأنه كان 
ibn Askari. He hasn't been able to contact his father for seven years because uh, the rebels would uh, prevent the father from using a cell phone or mobile phone. Do you know that you were ibn Askari? He has been insulted several times because they knew that his son was a soldier. هلا كيف كيف حاسس هلا؟ هلا انا حاسس الشعور لا يوصف وشو عم تعمل هلا انتم؟ في حدا لسه ما شفته؟ لسه في اهل لسه عم يدوروا عليهم لسه رجعوا ان شاء الله تعالى من عائلتك اخواتك ولا عائله كبيره؟ اخي لا من عائلتي واخواتي اه ذا سولجر ناو از ويتنج از سيرشينج اكشلي فور هيز براذر تو بي تو سي هيم افتر هي فاوند هيز فاذر يعطيكم العافيه اه ذيس وومن اوفر ذير شي از فينتينج She's fainting from uh, the, the long trip out of Eastern Ghouta. Her family are trying to support her and they're trying to... Um, trying to make her feel better after the long suffering she has, been in, she has endured for the trip out of Eastern Ghouta to reach here. So as we have mentioned, all of these people are waiting for their turn to get on the bus and to go to a shelter to to relax after three days of strenuous effort to leave uh, their areas and to seeking sa safety. Uh, around 100 uh, people uh, uh, in each uh, bus because uh, the, 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 uh, the, this large number of people wasn't expected to leave in such a uh, short notice thousands are leaving so it needs some preparation so uh, as we have uh, mentioned before uh, thousands of people are fleeing their areas in eastern Ghouta which is uh, uh, under the rebel control of course, the evacuation of civilians, of thousands of civilians, is taking place after the Syrian army advanced in eastern Ghouta and captured over 70% of that area, opening humanitarian corridors for the people to leave. And once those humanitarian corridors were opened, once the Syrian army advanced, actually, the people fled those areas, speaking about their tough lives for the past six years. Families have been separated people haven't seen the capital city for a long long time now for the first time they are they are able to 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 live in safety and to to have a normal life sort of a normal life again after the long years of living under the rebel held areas in Istanbul